everyone. I'm Donna Bush with your CID TV News Brief on this Tuesday. The Cayman Islands government is asking the public to take part in an important annual hurricane survey located online at gov.ky. Now, the survey is important for government communication before, during, and after a hurricane. Hurricane season started on June 1st and ends on November 30th. Again, go online to gov.ky to take the survey titled Take the Hurricane Preparedness Survey. The Ministry of Youth, Sports, Culture and Heritage is hosting a press conference this Friday, the 8th of July at 10 a.m. to unveil its 2022 plans for Pirates Week celebrations. Now, the reveal will be announced by Minister the Honourable Bernie Bush. Also attending the briefing will be Minister for Planning, Agriculture, Housing and Infrastructure, the Honourable J.E. Banks, who will outline the content and structure of the festival last held in November 2019. You can watch Friday's press briefing on the Cayman Islands YouTube channel and Facebook page, as well as on your local cable channels, Logic Channel 23, Flow Channel 106, and C3 Channel 3. Recently, 12 boys and girls left their primary school years at West End Primary on Kim and Brack behind to move on to high school. Family teachers and the island's MPs, including Minister for Education, the Honorable Juliana O'Connor Connolly, were there to witness the students being presented with their certificates and awards. But your journey, yes, it's important, yes, it's essential, yes, it's paramount. But you have to keep your eyes on the end point. You have to keep your doesn't mean that you do it in a course when you cheat on your examination or you um, go on your computer and you get your dad to fill it up from COVID because you're too busy playing games. That's not the journey that you always talk about. It's about you yourself being the best boy and girl that you can. Why is that important? Because we know this what we rock, yes? And we want to make our parents proud. We want to make our leaders proud. We want to make ourselves Held at the Aston Ruddy Center, the theme of the West End Primary School's school leaving ceremony is one more step along the road. We say congratulations to the students and invite you to join us for highlights from Creek and Spot Bay Primary School's school leaving ceremonies on Wednesday evening. The forecast for uh, tonight calls for partly cloudy skies with a 30% chance of showers. Winds will be east to northeast at 5 to 10 knots. Seas will be slight to moderate with wave heights up 2 to 4 feet. The two-day outlook is for light to moderate winds along with uh, slight to moderate seas, which can be expected across the Cayman Islands area through to Thursday morning. Now, the synopsis shows loud, uh, cloudiness and showers, which are expected over the Cayman Islands area for the next 24 hours as that high upper level low pressure system weakens over the Western Caribbean region. A reminder that you can find the latest on local weather conditions online at weather.gov.ky. And that's it for today's news brief here on CIG Television. I'm Donna Bush, as always, inviting you to join us again on Wednesday evening. Until then, be safe. Seek the latest accurate information on COVID-19 only from official sources at gov.ky forward slash coronavirus.